Hi, this is Dr. Michael Ryan answering the question, uh, why is there pain in your leg after a Charlie horse or leg cramp? Charlie horse and leg cramp are somewhat interchangeable. Some people it means one thing and to others it means something different, but I'll consider that they're basically the same thing. A Charlie horse is a leg cramp. What a leg cramp is, is that the muscle is abnormally stimulated to contract and it contracts in an unusual way in that it's only part of the muscle or part of the leg and you, you haven't even uh, you know done anything to, to start it. It starts on its own. The other characteristic is it's extremely painful. When the muscle is, is, is contracting, it's con contracting in an uncontrolled manner, meaning it, normally a muscle will contract and relax, contract and relax. This one continu continues to, to contract for several minutes. During that period of time, the reason why it hurts so much is that the little blood vessels that go into the muscle are, are constricted and pinched off by the muscle itself that's contracting. The result is that the muscle uh, ends up getting uh, what we call ischemic. That's the medical word for poor blood flow, poor oxygen to the muscle. And that actually creates a kind of a, uh, an injury to the muscle. And that injury is, uh, is associated with a lot of, of painful sensations. It's very uncomfortable. The same thing happens when you're having a heart attack. That's why people have chest pain. It's called ischemia. Well, reduced blood flow to the heart causes chest pain. Reduced blood flow to the, the leg muscle causes leg cramp pain. Uh, what happens with the leg cramp is that it actually ends up uh, resulting in this poor blood flow, which then causes the muscle to stop contracting. It doesn't have enough blood flow to continue contracting. And um, also, there's a tremendous amount of what's called lactic acid. That's a, a byproduct of muscle contraction when it's really working hard. The lactic acid is very uh, painful. It burns and, and causes the muscle also to fatigue and, and basically stop contracting. After that's all done, and it usually is over within three to five minutes of, for everyone that has one, knows how painful they are. What you're left with is a localized injury to the muscle. The muscle's been contracting with poor blood flow and it causes damage to the tissue. The muscles contracting doesn't have adequate blood flow and it damages itself. The result is it's very tender and it's tender for actually most people for at least a day, sometimes two or three days. And that is because of how a cramp works. The cramps with vein conditions are very common. We see them every day of the week. They, uh, the pattern is also very specific in that leg cramps or foot cramps occur in the evening or at night. They can occur during the day, but they always occur in people with a vein condition at night or uh, in the evening. And that predicts that you, A, have a vein reflux problem, and B, vein treatments will help. And surprisingly, uh, and this is a medical mystery, when people have, that, um, have those, vein, have those uh, leg cramps due to a vein reflux condition, their leg cramps very predictably go away the night of the first treatment for most patients, which is, for people that have leg cramps regularly, that's a miracle. So this is Dr. Michael Ryan answering the question, why does a charley horse or leg cramp hurt?